Hi, my name is Grant Schmidt, and this is your Shot Tech Tuesday tip. Some people have trouble racking the slide. They have trouble pulling it to the rear, and they may get stuck here without able to pull it all the way back. It's critical to know how to rack the slide so that you can lock the slide to the rear foremost for making sure that you have an empty firearm, and of course, for the loading and unloading process as well. So uh, we're gonna start with progression of exercises, uh, and that's gonna get you to a point where you're just as proficient as you know, the, the best of them. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with an unloaded gun and an empty magazine well. Now, obviously to make sure this is an unloaded firearm, we need to rack the slide. So first, it's critical is to start with an empty magazine well. There may very well be a round in here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take an empty magazine. We're ensuring that there's no bullet in the magazine. Next, I'm going to insert it into the magazine well. And if you have a hammer fired gun, great. Um, we can, that, and it's a functional firearm, uh, we can pull a, the, the hammer rearward, lock it rearward, and that's gonna give us an easier time, but it's not necessary. Next, what we're gonna do is you're going to, with your non-dominant hand, grab onto the slide serrations on the slide. You're going to grip it. You can also place your palm over top and then use your, your four fingers if you get better um, purchase on the slide serrations that way. And then the next thing you know, you're gonna do is you're gonna push forward with your dominant hand. Again, finger off the trigger, safe direction. Push forward with your dominant hand while pulling with your non-dominant hand. And all you're gonna do is grip it and rip it. The magazine follower on the empty magazine is going to uh, allow the slide to lock to the rear without you working with the slide stop. All right, so all we're gonna do is we're gonna push, pull really quick like you're pulling on a lawnmower right? And because the empty magazine is in there, if we had a round in the chamber that on a functioning firearm, the round would eject and the slide would lock to the rear because of that magazine. Next, we can eject the empty magazine and now we can confirm this is an unloaded gun. And if you were storing it, you can grip and rip again. This has a hammer uh, release. So we can press that for a hammer fired gun, striker fired gun. Don't worry about it. Um, now we are sure we have an unloaded firearm, we can go and place it back in the safe. And doing that exercise will allow you to become familiar with the strength and the muscle memory to charge the slide as you need to. Um, and once you're familiar with that and you're comfortable with that, you can work on adding the fine motor skill of pushing the slide stop up so that you can lock the slide to the rear. Um, so that's your quick tip. Use an empty magazine to start with and then go from there. I'm Grant Schmidt. This has been your Shot Tech Tuesday tip.